And is anybody noticing apple, citrus, pear, soft fruit? Anything else from this one? Grapes. Grapes. <laughs> <laughs> That's a new one. Never heard that one before. Hello from Niagara Falls. Minasan, konnichiwa. Niagara Falls ni yatte kimashita. Right behind me is the Niagara Falls and it's absolutely a breathtaking view. This is actually my first time at Niagara Falls and what can I say? It is beautiful. But for a California boy like myself, it is freezing. Maji de ima 0 do gurai nan desu kedo, yappa California sodachi no boku ni totte wa chotto samusugi desu. Anyway, we are going to go on a wine tour today. It's called the Winter Wine Tours of Niagara Falls. I am by no means a wine snob, which is a wine ni urusai hito. Nor am I a wine connoisseur, which is wine ni kubashii hito. I just enjoy my cheap wines from Trader Joe's, just a guy that loves drinking wine casually. Anyway, uh, we're going to hit up about five different wine tours today, and you guys are going to join along on this wine tour with me. Hope you guys enjoy it, and I think uh, the bus is coming right now. Let's go check it out. <laughs> We're going to be doing three different wines today, first of which is our 2014 Riesling. And I choose this one because I feel it's just about our best example of what we can do here at Lely in terms of a white wine. Very expressive, very aromatic, uh, light, crisp, refreshing, off dry, which means just a touch of sweetness to it, uh, which makes it very approachable, even for people who aren't so uh, big on wines. This one kind of like a gateway wine. <laughs> Very popular. <laughs> Either by the stem or by the base. And once we all have one, I'll explain why. So feel free to come up, grab a glass. Uh, don't chug it back yet. I will <laughs> explain how to properly chug it back. All right, when we're evaluating a wine, there's three things that we want to look at, which are appearance, nose, and palate. Or in English, how it looks, how it smells, and how it tastes. And the color of a wine can give us some clues about its age. A white wine will develop a brighter, bolder color as it ages, whereas a red will do the opposite and it'll fade. This one being a Riesling 2014 from Niagara, this is exactly what we want to see. A textbook example of a Lely Riesling. Okay, when we come to taste a wine, what I'll do is demonstrate a wine snobs technique of tasting a wine, then I'll explain what I did and why I did it. So. Eyes on the teacher class, here we go. <laughs> All right guys, we are back at the hotel. And as you can see, we have a spectacular view of the Niagara Falls. I just learned this today, but they actually light up the Niagara Falls with different colors. Right now it's blue, but it could be yellow, red, purple, just a lot of different beautiful colors. Now, to recap the day, I ended up going to five different wineries. I've tried out everything from the Sauvignon Blanc, which is the white wine, to the Merlot and the Cabernet, which is a red wine. But we can't forget about the most popular wine in this Niagara region, which is the ice wine. Ice wine については, chotto nihongo de setsumeshimasune. アイスワインの特徴はマイナス 10 10粒ほど出てくるのが 
このマイナス8度の時は one drop だけなんですねその凍った時に絞ると水分が全部なくなってもう完全に甘い甘い甘いワンになります今夜はこれをちょっと飲みながら、えー、ここ最後ナイアガラの一日を過ごしたいと思います Well, that's gonna wrap up our wine trip here in the Niagara Fall regions. I hope you guys had a really good time. I'm hoping that I get to go to Napa Valley next. Napa Valley still has a special place in my heart, and I want to share with that with you guys next time. Well, thanks for watching today, and I will catch you guys again next time. Take it easy, y'all. Peace.